All right, let's get back to the survey, though, all right, because basically what they're saying is is that we are happier in our early adult life and that women are more likely than men to fulfill their aspirations earlier related to material goods and family. That is true, wouldn't you say, Tracy? And, and, it, and a good thing. It takes men longer to figure out what they want to do in life. Well, I just think this whole notion of basing your happiness on material goods is part of the problem, hence part of the reason that this thing was run by men in the first place. If there were women on the panel, Tracy. if there were women on the panel, they would, I mean, ask any woman if she would choose her car over her children and she'd take the kids any day, whereas I would question a lot of men out there, quite frankly. Tracy, I can't believe what I just heard you say. There's a reason that women live longer, Mark. Let me tell you. It is because we are stronger yes. and we are happier at the end of the day than most men. And that yes. is factual and you know it. When, when men are married to women who scream like you, they just want to die sooner. I'm not screaming when you have any, you When you are. have women going no, around, not, you're Tracy. She left you. Let's Tracy. put that on the table if you Tra want to play this game. Tra Tracy, yes. when women go around comparing their engagement rings to show off who got the most carrots, Whoa, I don't, know don't where you tell find me that women, women don't compete. Mark, don't I don't know where you that find women these women. The women I know do not possessions. care about that kind of stuff. Mark, All right, Mark, get out more. Women compete on houses, divorce settlements, carrots, country clubs. Women compete on money all the time. Give me a break. Well, wait a you second. Got the wrong wait women a second, in your life, Mark, buddy. Mark. Well, Mark, wait a second. Uh, the, the stature of a yes. lot of men is measured in the car they drive, the golf country club they belong to, and very much the place they live in. You have to admit that. And and whether or not their wives are staying at home and not working. That's exactly what I said at the beginning. Oh, That's because men are taught that the way the men are taught that they have to make women happy. The, the fact of the matter is, you can't make anybody happy. You have to make yourself happy. Happiness is a byproduct of achievement. So for women to say that they're unhappy, it's their own fault. Anybody who says he's unhappy, it's oh his own goodness, fault. Mark, Everybody I'm, has to I'm make himself or herself to you. happy. You're giving me such a bloody headache. Yeah, I mean, where are you from? Where are you from, dear Trace, Lord? I would never in a Trace, million years teach my girls that they have to grow up to be reliant on a man, as you can well imagine. I would never teach my son well, uh, that he should wonderful. be attracted. That's wonderful. But Tracy, you're the same whoop, one. You're whoop. the same one who bragged that she's so strong and so tough and doesn't need a man's money. Yet you're taking alimony. I oh. have three children. Okay, Mark. Who, Mark? You know what, so, Mark, but you don't need a, a man's okay, money. Right, but that's it. 